Hi, I'm Lisa Worrell. I am a former employee of the Allen County Public Library. Uh, I used to manage the Pontiac branch for a number of years, and now I am a member of the Friends of the Library Board and the ACPL Foundation. And when I worked here, one of the programs that the Friends of the Library funded was uh, an outreach to women living in recovery and transitional living at Genesis House. And I would go there um, and do book club with them, and we read a lot of different inspiring books. And this is a letter from one of the participants who graduated from the program and is um, just really being very successful in life right now. I have always loved to read. Growing up, you could always find me tucked in with a blanket and a book or under the tree with snacks and the same. Reading was how I tuned out the noise and visited places I could only imagine. But of course, as I grew up in the throes of having children, an unhealthy marriage, struggles with addiction and mental health issues, I lost sight of my positive and very beneficial escape. Fast forward to just a relatively short time ago, I was in the middle of sorting myself out at Genesis House. I had been completely dedicated to the program and working and my kids. And if I'm being honest, I was a bit overwhelmed and felt like I was definitely lacking something, some me time, if you will. Well, then one Monday evening, I was rushing out to yet another group or meeting, and here comes Mrs. Lisa to the door with a box of books. She said, I'm here to do book club. I guess nobody had bothered to mention it, to me anyways. At first I thought, oh my goodness, I can't handle anything else. Of course, I didn't say that. I smiled and took her book and said I was looking forward to it. That was my introduction to Brene Brown. I am in love. I won't go into detail on the topics. I don't suppose it's important, really. My focus here is just the fact that I was forced, for lack of a better word, to take time out of my busy day to sit back and relax and read. In all honesty, I thoroughly enjoyed it. I forgot how much I enjoyed it, actually. And then our actual book club meetings. I can't even begin to explain how nice it was to be able to sit down and actually talk about something that we all had in common, this book, and as it related to life. I want to express my gratitude for you and Mrs. Lisa. She and your contributions have been a phenomenal part in my recovery, rediscovering myself and my sociability, and ultimately reigniting my love of literature. She reminded me that it's okay to read just for fun. I've since reread a dozen books, at least, ranging from Pierce Anthony to Ray Bradbury and back to many more Brene Brown and Melody Beatty. I'll hold on to my first book club forever. Thank you.